Today I'm going to show you a police radar script created by this person. I'll be linked to the resource in the creator's preview in the description. I hope you enjoyed the video. First, click the link in the description that takes you to the resource. In the README section, you can find the preview and dependency, which is Oxlip, so make sure you have that installed and ensured properly. So go back up and download it. Once it's done, open it up and open your server resources. And add it in. I'm putting it in a folder that's already insured after the dependency, so if you put it somewhere else, make sure it's starting correctly. And of course, make sure to move the main from the end. Then go into the resource folder and open the config. The first thing is the language, and there's an option for the default state of the radar, which will be showing. Next are the command and keybind to show or hide the radar, and the unit of speed, which is kilometer per hour or miles per hour. Then there's another command and keybind to lock the radar. The command to change the radar position and the time the radar updates. If you make changes, be sure to save them, then start your server and test it out. To show or hide the radar, you can type slash radar or press F7. If it's binded to something else and you want to change it, you can do so in the 5M keybind settings. You can also do it for the keybind to lock the radar. So go to the settings and then to key bindings, then to the 5M section and find the ones that say empty police radar. And since I'm using F7 for something else, I'll rebind it to F2. And then if you want to change the one for locking and unlocking the radar, you can do so there. So I'll bring it up again, then use the command slash POS radar to change the position. I'm just going to move it down a bit. And there is fine. And then escape to get out of that. So I'm going to go ahead and get behind this vehicle. When you follow them or when they pass, you can see the speed and the plate. So as you can see, the speed is increasing. I'll go ahead and use F6 to lock the information. It lets you know the radar was locked. When I turn away, the information is still saved there. That'll be all for this video. If you enjoyed and it helped you out, please leave a like and a sub. If you have any suggestions, feel free to comment down below or join my Discord. The link will be in the description. Thank you for watching.